hello everyone welcome back to crown geek in this video i will be explaining that how to fix updates are underway please keep your computer on this is an error message that comes up while restarting rebooting or your while shutting down the windows 10 or windows 11 computer so right now i have this message on my windows 11 and when i try to restart it just is stuck onto the screen that says updates are underway please keep your computer on all right so you do not need to get panic what you have to do here you just need to forcefully shut down your computer so this can be your pc this can be your laptop whichever device you're using you can use the power button to forcefully shut down the computer so press the power button hold it for a few seconds until this screen gets shut down so once the computer gets shut down you need to restart it again and the next time when it will restart you will see such kind of a screen coming up and again it will give you a message updates are underway but that will just for a while okay so you have to wait and then finally you will be getting this login screen so once you come to this login screen you need to enter your password so now you can see the windows 11 screen is coming up and it's a regular normal screen but now in order to completely fix it you have to go with few more troubleshooting steps so first what you will have to do you need to click on the search box type cmd command prompt will be coming up you need to make a right click on it and then choose run as administrator then click on yes the black window will be coming up now here you have to run two different command in order to just fix any kind of integrity violation and any kind of health problem with the windows operating system so the first command will be dism space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space restore health now this command you will get in the description you can copy and paste here and now you will be getting a message deployment image services management tool now this will take some time so you will have to wait until this is 100 percent completed so meanwhile you can minimize it and next you have to click on the search box type here troubleshoot then click on troubleshoot settings Now here you have to click on other troubleshooter and then you have to look for windows update on the right of it you will find the run option click on run and then it will start detecting the problem and if there is any problem with windows update then it will kindly let you know so wait until you get any kind of suggestion or any kind of or fix from this windows update troubleshooter so now the troubleshooting has been completed and it says pending system changes that require a reboot has been detected so what we will do here we will click on next and then it will show you that it's resolving the problem so again wait until this has been completed so meanwhile it's resolving the problem you have to go back again to the command prompt where we just ran a command and still it's running so again we will wait until this is 100 percent completed all right so the troubleshooting has been completed and it says problem found check for pending restart check for windows update issues so there is a problem with windows update issues that probably is because the health of the computer is not fine so what you can do you can close it here and again open the command prompt where you just ran a command and it says the operation completed successfully and now you also need to run the next command that is sfc space forward slash scan now now again this will be scanning for all the system file for any kind of integrity violation so kindly wait until the process has been completed so this command has been also completed and it says windows resource protection found corrupt file and successfully repaired them so probably this was the problem why you were getting that kind of updates or underway problem error messages so now what you have to do you need to close it and now you can use your computer next time when you will restart your pc you won't be getting that message anymore Hopefully guys this will work for you as well and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe for any question let me know in the comment section. Till then take care bye bye.